Hello, hello, hello. I am Dr. Tooth Puller, and today we'll be showing you how we take out wisdom teeth. So we have a patient here who's having trouble from his wisdom teeth for the past week or so, and he's got infection in the top and the bottom wisdom teeth on the left side, which is the maxillary wisdom tooth, which is the third molar on the top left, and also the bottom wisdom tooth on the left side. And he's been chewing on that gum, which is covering the wisdom tooth. Technically, that is called perichronitis. Peri means around, chronitis means the crown of the tooth, so there's inflammation around the crown. So we'll show you that, and let's go ahead and take so this is the portion of the panoramic x-ray of the left side of the wisdom tooth. You can see the bottom one there with a little bit of infection around it, a little dark shadow behind, and the top wisdom tooth there. Okay, let's check. Does this hurt at all? You feel a little pressure, but it shouldn't hurt. Looks good? Uh-huh. Excellent. Let's section this out. Let's see. The first molar, second molar, third molar, you can see a little bit of that third molar right there. And we will expose it so we can see it completely. Little pressure here you'll feel. Make a little cut there and see how it looks. Once we can visualize it, it'll be easy to take it out. So let's see. That looks pretty good. Here you go. And we're gonna stretch the gun. Keep it nice and dry, little pressure. You'll feel a little bit of pushing. If at all it hurts, raise your left hand for me, okay? Good, because we know you can't talk right now. So here you go, lots of pressure. And there you go. Push, 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 we're gonna see that too. There you go, we can see the whole thing around, very nice. Excellent. So, I'm gonna retract it further so we can see it better. Excellent, section it out for us, and here you go. Millie, you can take this from me. Go ahead, from the top, and down, thank you. Let me reposition that for you. Take it out. And all the way. Get your three-point contact, great. Let's check this. Now you're gonna feel a little bit of vibration and a lot of water spray. Just like I said, we're gonna trim the tooth into like a little baby tooth and take it out in a couple of pieces. Chin down a little bit for me. And nice deep breath through the nose. So here you go, section in the front, please. There you go, lots of buzzing. Very good, plenty of water. Excellent. Raise your hand if it bothers you or hurts at all, but lots of vibration, yes. Plenty of water spray, we'll clean this out all of this stuff, great. Very well done, nice and smooth, pressure, 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 all along the tooth here. Very good, thank you. And follow with your section please. Thank you, nice. A little bit here to smooth out the bone. Very good. And even it out. That's our little space where we make to take the teeth out on the outside. And the buckle gutter. Well, the tooth has some space to move. Good. Okay, nice. And now I'm going to trim it into two. So let's see. Relax your tongue. You're doing very good. Nice deep breath through the nose. That'll help as well because you're getting nitrous oxide. That'll help you relax a little bit. Excellent. Nice. So let's see. We're making a little groove in the tooth so that we can split it into two. Little baby teeth. There you go. Because on the whole, it's huge. 
big molar tooth. You become more comfortable and controlled to take it out when you split it into two. There you go, nice and smooth, good. We don't go all the way, we protect the tongue side of the tooth, which is the lingual side. And so there's nerves there, we won't want to affect them at all. So we'll keep it on our side here. Okay, good. Let's see. Thank you. Isaac, hold it for me. And well, give me a suction. Here you go. Let's see here. Stretch it out and hold it right there. Go for it from the outside. Thank you. Suction from the tongue side. You can retract it a little bit. Great. And we'll show you the little cut on the tooth. Usually about two thirds of the tooth on this side looks very good, right on. It's like a textbook style. Good. Hold on, let me retract again. See if the soft tissue is nice and smooth and protected. Great. That was the flap on the buckle. You need to keep it good for it to heal better. Excellent. We'll put a little gauze in here. Open gauze, please. Thank you. You can take the periosteal out, please. This is like a little net to catch any portion of the tooth that tries to go the other way, huh? Where it's not supposed to down your throat. So that'll catch it like a little net. Thank you. And now suction, please. Let's see. You're gonna feel a little pressure pushing like this, but it shouldn't hurt. And you'll hear a little cracking sound. We're gonna divide the tooth into two here. You got a little pressure, crack, crack, crack. Let's see, very good. Now let's see how it looks inside. Okay, you must have ready for me. Here you go, hold this and we'll pick it up for you. Let's see, we don't want it to go there, so here it is. That's one portion of it, thank you. Back end, cover the back of the mouth like a little net to catch the tooth. So let's count that we are on the right two. That's first molar, second molar, third molar. That was the one. You can see it's slightly erupted further down. You're gonna feel a little pressure like this. People pushing around in that open. Open a little bit for me. Thank you, that's enough. Little pressure and pushing. So here you go. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Let me see if I can get it in the right spot. Good, excellent. We'll try one more time. Turn this way. Little pressure. And this next elevator up, please. Thank you. There you go. Let's have a look. Pressure again on the tooth. Let's see if it comes down smooth. All we're trying to do is loosen it up at this stage. Good. Very nice. You can see it move and cracking sounds, huh? Easy. If it hurts or whatever, ray, let us know. Raise your right hand and we'll stop right away, okay? Chin up a little bit. Let's see. Good. And relax. Let me see if I can help it. Release from the soft tissue. Yes, I'm going to retract, please. Thank you. Good. Let's see all around this, dude. Good. Here you go. Nice. And chin up a little bit and to the right. Thank you, I'm gonna stretch it out so we can see all around the tooth. Turn away from me a little bit, great. Good, now you get the light right on. And let's see here. Good, thank you, get rid of this. Suction, suction, suction. Excellent, all around the tooth. Very good. A little piece. There you go, now it's moving slowly. Very nice. Let's see if I can grab it. Very good. That one came out without the forceps. Smooth. Very good. And I'm going to have a look inside the mouth to make sure that it's all clear. Looks nice and clean in there. Let's see if you can do a little trick for me. Close your lips and puff up your cheeks like a balloon. Don't let the air come out. Puff up your cheeks. This is to check, there's no sinus communication, poof, and you can relax. That looks great. Excellent. And 
clean this out with some salty water, you're all done, my man. Clean up time, lots of water. We'll section all of this out. Wash, 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 wash. Excellent. I'm just gonna put a little stitch at the back just to give the gums a little bit of help behind the second molar to heal a little bit better. That's it. Turn away from me a little bit. Thank you. Close halfway for me. Excellent. Then I can see and I can get that distal suture. Open a little bit. Open. There you go. Nice. Keep your tongue Let down. Let me see if I can tongue. grab it. And that's it. And this is mostly to help heal the second molar. Right here. Open big. Thank you. Excellent. Almost finishing up there. Good. Nice. All finished up. And that's it. All the nastiness is done. Tooth out. Nice and clean. Let me give it a good clean up around and then we'll have a look see how the result looks like retraction please man and let's have a look chin down for me open break and have a look right there clean up. great and that's it perfect if need be you can put in a gauze pack here for the patient to bite on but it has to be moist so it does not Stick to the cloth and then pull it out. So let's see if it is. Here you go. Open for me. And gently bite on it nice and tight. Has to be behind the teeth. Perfect, you got it. 